Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 20th. So we're just going to see what comes up. I might do two, two dailies for today, one this morning and one tonight. So what do we have for the 20th? This reading may or may not be for you, and the timing is fluid. So what do we have? Hangman. Hangman. That's somebody that is going through a state of enlightenment. Um, learning some kind of lesson. Thinking about what has happened. Three of coins. Now this is working together. Collaborating. Communicating. compromising so thinking about what has happened thinking about it thinking about compromising because this is thinking hmm. mm. five of wands reverse and the ace of pentacles so this is a new opportunity i see the one thinking about is this the one is this the one because i just happened to notice the one is this the one so this is definitely an opportunity. You see the one? Okay, so there's a golden opportunity here. Somebody has manifested something solid, stable, secure. You notice the key. The key. This And there's a ring here too. Interesting. Definitely the one. So somebody may be thinking this might be the one. This might be the one that I want to work with. Now... They're thinking about it. They're thinking about the one. They are. They're thinking about the opportunity. They're thinking about um, now there's been some sort of competition. Maybe they're thinking about um, not engaging with the competition because this is not playing upright. It's playing. They're thinking about compromising and working with somebody that they have been sparring with or, or playing with or fighting with they may think this is the one this is the one I know this is the one so interesting but this is a golden opportunity to maybe make peace perhaps with the five of wands reversed because it's done playing not fighting cooperate definitely cooperating here we have an individual who has been stubborn trying to prove a point of some sort because that's what the hangman does somebody's been trying to prove a point but now they're going to be cooperating they see an opportunity this is a big opportunity with the ace of pentacles there's potential there's potential for long-term security long-term stability permanence here this can lead to something very, very stable and solid and secure, put it that way. Abundance. This is, this is, this is, somebody may be getting a gift as well because the Ace of Pentacles can be a gift. Hmm. Ooh, the chariot. This is an arrival. Somebody's coming. This is, this is, somebody may be delivering something. This is taking a ride, going for a ride, getting in the seat, getting on the seat, taking charge. Somebody is arriving. They're coming with maybe a gift. I don't know if they're coming with a gift or not. doesn't have to be, but this is a golden opportunity. Somebody has manifested a new opportunity. They're taking action by the looks of things. Got to go time to go it's time to go somewhere so taking a ride towards something solid somebody is definitely taking a ride with that chariot card and somebody has something to do with a bike because there's a bike here hmm. headed towards the one somebody is headed towards the one there's going to be some sort of communication this person has been thinking a lot the moon. The moon's going to be dealing with the Pisces. Could be dealing with the Cancer. We have Pisces twice right here. 
So this is, we could be dealing with a Pisces, could be dealing with a Cancer. Um, doesn't have to be, but this isn't it. Somebody has been hiding their feelings. They have been. They've been very stubborn, thinking about what has happened, thinking about compromising, thinking about communicating, working with somebody. There's been some sort of competition. There's been some sort of fighting or sparring or something like that. But now this is cooperation and compromising. This may be the one. This is a golden opportunity to... Uh, take control or something like that to be in control to mat this is an individual that is mastering their emotions they're taking a ride they're delivering something they are definitely delivering something the moon there's something hidden all is not as it seems something is about to show up <laughs> there's hidden forces here with the moon Proceed with caution. Yeah. And listen to your intuition. You may want to look a little bit deeper. Somebody is looking a little bit deeper. They're looking They're looking really deep. They're looking really deep into um, some sort of opportunity to work with somebody that they feel like is, you know, the one, whatever the hell that is. King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. So it doesn't have to be, but this is somebody that is looking for a relationship, looking for love that is going to be expressing their feelings. This is definitely a very feeling energy right here. This person has been really thinking about what their heart wants. They've been thinking about um, love and what love is. This is an individual who is very... Uh, kind and loving and feeling and um, is looking for love really look at what is it is gonna it looks like he's making an offer as well or you know expressing feelings that they've been hiding somebody's been hiding their feelings but they're going to be expressing their feelings very charming and romantic ooh ten of cups reversed Ten of Cups reverse. That is a relationship that has broken up. And maybe this is somebody from the past. I don't know. The Ten of Cups reversed is a brokenness, a broken relationship. A dying dream. Somebody's dreams were dashed and they've been thinking about it. They've been thinking about their relationship. They've been thinking about being in a relationship, about who they love or something like that. There's been, a, there's been some sort of competition. There's been some sort of argument and there's been a lack of peace. Five of swords. No, why did I say five? It's the two of swords. I knew it was the Two of Swords. The Five of Swords came out for a reason. The Five of Swords has been some, some sort of fight, obviously, belittling power struggle. Somebody was belittled because we had one individual or both individuals that wanted to win at all costs. But now there's a battle between head and heart and there's some sort of blocking. Somebody has been blocked. But now there's a golden opportunity. There definitely is because that's a golden opportunity to take action and deal with the emotions. Somebody's been blocking their feelings and their emotions as well. There's been a level of indecision. And it, there's been a, it's been painful. It's been stressful. Somebody's been having a hard time facing their fears. They've been blocking their feelings. They may have had some sort of divided loyalty. They've been in denial. They've been unable to see the truth. But it feels like now, now they're seeing something more clearly. They are. They've become enlightened in some way. They've really been thinking a lot. Thinking about their, their past relationship. Thinking about what their heart wants. Thinking a lot, 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 lot. Now they're going to, to, be, to be getting in the driver's seat. They're going to be going somewhere. There's going to be a delivery. 
they're making a choice. They're making a choice, head versus heart. They're definitely making a choice. King of, yeah, making a, a decision, a decision. They've been investigating, they've been watching. This is somebody that is very smart, very intelligent, hasn't been communicating, had been thinking, been thinking long and hard about what they want. And they've been be trying to be very logical. The reason that they haven't come forth is because they've been using logic. They've been following their head and not their heart. That's why. You notice the heart is now covered up. And, and so we have an individual here that has been really, really thinking about a, a relationship and, and moving into it and wanting to communicate and wanting to open their heart. But they're, it is mind versus heart, seriously. But they have been following their head. They haven't been listening to their heart. They haven't been listening to their heart. But I think that they are making a decision now. A decision is being made. A decision is being made. Whereas they weren't following their heart at all in the past. They were not. But now they are determined. They are very determined to win. Because the chariot is win. They're determined to win something. They're going to they're gonna take. They're going to fight for something. They're going to fight for uh, because this is, this is competition as well. The seven of wands are going to fight for the, the position. They're going to fight for the top. Okay. They're going to put in effort. They are, they're not going to give up. Somebody is going to put in effort to be on top, you know, knight of cups. Oh my God. So this is somebody who wants to be in a relationship. They're going to be expressing their feelings. No doubt about it. This is the night. I'm telling you what. And this may be somebody from the that you have dealt with before with the Ten of Cups reversed. Maybe they didn't want to be in the relationship or they moved or something like that. But whoever this person is, I think that they are going to be expressing their feelings. Um, they're offering some sort of um it's love. It's I mean, we got the King of Cups, we got the Knight of Cups, they want a relationship. They want to build, they want to build a relationship, or they just, I don't know, they're saying something. They're saying something in regards to, you know, love with that Knight of Cups. An offer of love or compassion or wanting a relationship or, you know, they're giving you something very loving, okay? This person... um is definitely deciding to open their heart. They're opening their heart and they're making, they're giving something. They're giving something very um, heartfelt. Okay, this is heartfelt. I'm going to be expressing their feelings. Page of Cups, right in the middle and reversed. There could be some tears. This could be intense. This could definitely be intense. There's been a rejection, though, because this person was emotionally immature. They were. Maybe they weren't ready for a commitment or they weren't ready for a relationship, but now they are. Okay? They were hiding their feelings. They were unable to communicate their feelings or express their feelings. And maybe now they've been in an unrequited love situation, which has enlightened them. Something like that. There's definitely some sort of enlightenment here with that hangman. Somebody has been struggling because they were trying to prove a point. Now, you know, maybe they've learned something. Maybe they've become more emotionally mature. Because we go from emotionally immature to mature. It's like they've grown up. They've really been thinking about what has happened. Yeah, third party situation. There may have been a termination of the third party. The third, If there was a third party... The party is over, okay? That third party is over. There's a strong competitiveness here. And somebody was lacking emotional growth and they needed to go through this experience to wisen up, perhaps. Anyhow, um, I feel like the third party has been terminated or something like that. Or they've, I don't know. Um, there's been some sort of... Uh, Maybe there's gossip or there's been other people involved that 
were giving somebody some some wrong information or they were telling somebody to do the wrong thing because they weren't really they were only caring about themselves anyway we have an individual that is about to take a ride because they want to be on top they want to they want to win. They want to. Um, they see a golden opportunity and they want to take it. They see. They may see somebody as the one. I feel like this is somebody that you know. I feel like this person has been fighting their heart. They've been trying to do the logical thing or or do what everybody else has told them to do. Um, but they've been thinking about what their heart wants, and I think that they're going to find their strength, their mental strength, to express their feelings and go against whoever these people are that don't agree or whatever. I think they've been hiding. They've been hiding uh, their true feelings for, I don't know how long, but for quite some time. But now they want to work together. They might see a value. They might see that, you know, this is really the one that I want to be with. And whoever they've been dealing with doesn't have their best interest at heart. Um, anyway, there's going to be an expression of love uh, that is absolutely real on um, right around the 20th. And there could be a gift or a delivery of some sort from this person. That maybe this person has been planning it. Uh, they've definitely been thinking. They've been thinking about their lack of of emotional growth, and they've they've. It feels like they've they've uh, grown up in some way. Something has happened which has caused them to um, want to put in effort. Something has happened that has caused them to want to fight for a relationship that they let go of. And I think they let go of it probably because of fear or something like that, you know. But anyway, there's a there's opportunity here. There's a new opportunity for something solid, stable, secure. An individual is coming in um, that wants to uh, prove themselves by the looks of things. So expect if this if this message is for you, there is a very heartfelt message coming from somebody that is uh, being very real. Good luck.